I'm just worried. I get scared. I think I'm losing you. When we're alone, when no one else is around, then, then it's all right, but when there are other people. You mean women? Clever women. I can't help it. I don't think anyone likes me. Including me? No. When, when I see you across the room with a girl, when I see you dancing with her, something inside of me jumps. I think I'll just have to have a drink or I'll do something terrible. Karen, you, you've got to stop thinking like that. All a man wants is someone who's simple and honest and who loves him. Don't you know that? My golly, if you carry on like this now, how are you going to act when we're married? Married? You never said that to me, ever. You never even asked me. I thought women were supposed to be intuitive. And after what I did to you tonight at the party? I happened to love you. Now, how soon can you fix your face? You just fixed it. Now, I don't suppose it's very romantic of me to bring it up at a time like this, but uh, you realize we haven't had any dinner yet? I'll only take a second. Darling. Yes? Those people at the party, you uh, work with a lot of them, don't you? Most of them. One way or another, yes. What I did, I... I guess they'll talk about it, won't they? I guess so. But something else will happen in a day or two. They'll forget all about it. Jeff? Yeah? Help me with these. I want to go back to the party. What? They won't know what to think, will they? They won't know exactly what to say, will they, Jeff? Well, who cares what they think? Okay, we'll go back and show them. Come on. I love you. Ah, I'm glad you came back. Renee, uh, I'd like to apologize. It's forgotten. <laughs> now, come on. Uh, can I get you a drink, Jeff? No, thanks, Renee. I'll pass. Jeff, boy, excuse, please. Men only. Back in a minute. <laughs> Would you like a ginger ale, dear? Oh, yes, thanks. A ginger ale for Miss Stewart, please. Hey, honey, darling, we're leaving. I'm sorry, would you excuse me? Oh, hello again. Hello. Where you been? Went out for a while. Me too. <laughs> like a light. <laughs> but I'm good as you. Would you care to join me? Oh. No, of course not. That's a silly question. Of course not what? Of course she wouldn't want to join me. You sound like the party wallflower. Right and wrong. Right, I am. Wrong, a wallflower is a girl. That's a feminine gender. I don't know what the masculine is for wallflower. Do you? I know another good word, antith antithesis. That means the opposite. Oh, well, that's my sister. She's the antithesis. Antithesis of wallflower, that is. Life of the party. I'm her kid brother. I drink. Well, she hates me for it. Great, so I drink even more.
Would you like to drink with me? No, thanks. I'm all right. You see that guy she's holding on to? He's crazy about him, flipped. He talks about him all the time. You know why? Because <laughs> he's going to marry some girl not in the business. <laughs> he's madly in love with her. Karen, Karen something or other. <laughs> hey, but you know, she's a drunk, my sister says. And you know, they never get over it. <laughs> Sis is counting on that, I guess. She's part Indian, collects scalps, mayo. But she never fails. <laughs> It isn't polite to take martinis away from the needy. Your need isn't as great as mine. Well, at least we have something in common. A need. A need for another drink. Yeah, let's. Double martini, please. Me too. Say, do you like the bars better on Lexington, Madison, or Third? Well, I'm a Third Avenue man myself. How about you? I'm impartial. I tell you what, we could start out on Lex and then go uptown and then downtown and then end up at a little bar I know on third. You know, this is going to be the start of a beautiful friendship. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Put it down. Sure. chug a -lug. Come on, Karen, let's go. Let us take you home, dear. You think I'm a fool. You think I don't know. No, Karen. Poor Jeff. Come on. Let's take you home. right now. I, I, I must have been pretty bad. Jeff never would have brought me here. Which hospital is this? This isn't exactly a hospital. It's the city jail. Why am I here? You killed a man last night. Jeff Simmons. His throat was cut with a brandy glass. 